So let me go back. It looks like November is the prostate cancer month where we celebrate awareness. So we will have a promotion of PSA testing for all men. Encourage above 50. If you have a family history, come to us above 40. Let's get the PSA done. If it's abnormal, your physician will be able to guide you. As I said, enlarged, uh, prost enlarged prostate BPH, benign prostatic hypertrophy, can give you an abnormal PSA. So every high PSA is not a deadly decision. Let's be sure that we get the ultrasound, we get the biopsy, and then the PSA may pet. So we have now 44 clinics. We have oncologists going to two of our satellite clinics at Mountain View and at Valley Arcade, where we are promoting prostate cancer awareness as well. And there is the oncologist there as well. Once you have been diagnosed with prostate cancer, the key treatment is either surgery, if it is localized, to remove the disease. If you cannot undergo surgery, we give you radiation. If it has spread, the best treatment is to cut off the growth factor that makes prostate cancer cells grow. And as I said, the growth factor for prostate cancer cells is testosterone. So we give you medication to decrease the level of testosterone, and that is part of the treatment of prostate cancer. And there are various ways to do that. They can be chemotherapy, they can be anti-hormone therapy. There are very new molecules today that specifically block the production of testosterone in the tumor itself. In fact, the tumor itself makes its own growth factor. So if you stop the hormones, you stop hormones, testosterone from the outside. It does not stop the testosterone made by the tumor itself. So we have new medications to stop that. Finally, you can even irradiate those cancer cells, either from external beam radiation that we can do here, or we can give you what we call lutetium PSMA, where there is a molecule which is radioactive that goes right to the tumor, attaches to the tumor, irradiates it. So there are very many ways to treat prostate cancer, but the key is early detection.